Hi, everyone. In this video, Iza will explain on how to solve exercise self-practice 5.1. Thanks to Iza for the great explanation. Let's watch the video. Hi. Today, i like to show how I did some of the some of the questions in self-practice 5.1 so i'm gonna start off with question 2a so first what we have to do is mark point o then we need to adjust the compasses to 3cm So that's done. Now we need to place a sharp point of the compasses on point O and draw a circle. Now we need to label the radius. For 3 cm. Now the uh, now we're moving on to question B. Same like before, we need to mark point O and Now we need to adjust the compasses to 4.5 cm. Place a sharp point of the compasses on point O and now we draw a circle. Now we need to label the radius. Now we're gonna move on to the third question. First, what we're going to do is join, join point O and Q with a straight line. Now we need to extend the line to the circumference. Do, so now we have to do the same thing with question B. Now we're going to move on to question four. Okay, so first we have to draw a circle with a radius of 3 cm.
adjust the compasses to 3 cm. Now we're going to draw the circle. So now what we have to do is mark point P. Okay, so now that's done. We need to adjust the compasses to 4cm, which is the length of the chord given by the question. By placing the compasses at point P, we're going to draw an arc that cuts on the circumference. I'll label the arc point A. Lastly, we need to connect point P and point A. So we're going to move on to question B. First, we need to draw a circle with a radius of 4.5 cm. Put it on point P and draw the circle. I'm sorry, draw draw the circle from point O. So now we need to mark point P. For the cord, we need to measure 6.7 centimeters. And draw an arc that cuts through the circumference. Now we mark point A. After that, we need to connect point P and point A. Now we're going to move on to the last question, question five. So first thing with the other questions, you need to mark point O and draw a circle with a radius of three, three cm for question A. Place the compasses at point O and draw the circle. So now we have to measure 70 degrees with a protractor.
uh, don't forget to draw a radius O and A. We're going to mark the, the other point we made, point B. Now we're going to move to question B. We have to draw a circle with a radius of 3.6 cm. Draw line O draw radius OA now we're going to measure 120 degrees with a protractor Don't forget to label your points A and B. So that creates the sectors. That's all for today.